Hey what's up creators and welcome back to the first hour of Unreal Engine course. In this video, we're going to be showing you how we can save and manage our levels inside of Unreal Engine, as you're now at a point where you've taken some objects, you've moved them around, and you're probably going to be really, really excited to start building your worlds. That being said, this quick video is going to show you how to make sure you can keep and continuously work on all of that. Let's jump straight into Unreal Engine. So inside of Unreal Engine, if you go over to File in the top left hand corner, you can create a new level by going to New Level. Inside of here, you've got a number of different template levels that you can work with. You can see we've got Open World and Empty Open World. This is going to be if you want to use World Petition and if you're going to have really massive, vast landscapes. In the case of us, where we're just going to be having a small platformer, that's where our basic and our empty level templates are going to come in. This basic template is just going to give us the sky, some clouds, the sun, and some basic atmosphere. Or you can use empty level, which is just going to be completely absent of anything. We're going to be using this basic template for now. So go ahead and create that new level. Now that we know how to create these new levels, I want to show you how we can save these and how you can access them a little bit later on. So inside of here, if we go up to file, and once we're ready to save our levels, we can go to save current level. This is going to prompt us to give our level a name, the level that we're working on. Now, what I actually recommend that you do is that you create a location specifically for your levels. So what I'm going to do inside of here is right click in the empty space, create a new folder, and I'm just going to give this the name levels. Then I'm going to press enter, double click on this. And now at the bottom, I can now give my level a name. I'm just going to give this the name PL underscore level one. The PL underscore is just the naming convention for where we have a persistent level. So just a complete level. This will all make a lot more sense once we get into Unreal Engine naming conventions. But I just want to start using these good practices as we begin. Go ahead and press save on that. Now that we've got this level saved, we can now just work in it and just control S to save this at any time. Also, if you'd like to open other levels that you've got, all you need to do is again, go to file, open level, and then choose your levels folder that you created, and then double click on that to open it up. Additionally, another way for you to get access to your levels that you've created is if you go down to your content drawer in the bottom left hand corner, you can then see your newly created levels folder and inside of here, any levels that you've created, you're going to be able to find inside of here and simply double click on these to open it up. This should now give you all the knowledge that you're going to need to be able to start building your worlds. You know how to manipulate assets and you know how to save your levels and return to them at any time. That's it for this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. Move on to the next video to continue your Unreal Engine learning journey. But as always, stay awesome, keep creating.